You guys check it out. It's a ceramic dragon. This looks like a um, like a Chinese dragon. I was looking and I can't find any sticker or any mark, but it's got these little the little felt feet. Usually are indicative of uh, 60s, 50s a lot of times, and they went three bucks for it. Ugh. If if I if I was getting a signal and I actually knew anything about it, I just don't want to buy stuff and stuff specifically that hasn't been selling. You know, it it's really hard to keep buying stuff when you haven't sold it. All right, that's a neat thing, but I'm gonna pass. Off I go. Hey guys, uh, I was digging around over here and I found this. It is crystal. Uh, look like. These are like the uh, like a lamp fixture crystals. Because you typically see, would see these things with um, uh, uh, chandeliers and stuff, but they're crystals. Wow! And there's a, there's two of them in there, and then they got this one finial over here. This guy here, or a little dangler thing. That's these things catch some pretty good money. I just I just don't have I have so much stuff. Wow! And they only went ten dollars ten dollars for for that stuff. Uh, I'd get them, but man, someone's gonna make some money off of that. It ain't gonna be me. Off I go. Hey guys, I just got in over here at uh, Manatee Memorial, and they had these. These are crystal uh, cut crystal balls. There's three of them over here, and I've been looking at them. They only went two dollars a piece. They're really scratched up, and they're they're chipped and dinged here and there, but they're really neat. That's just really cool. I actually looked over all looked over all three of them and they're they're just damaged so they've been rolling around on a table but wow if you just had to have it for your own thing you know and you wanted to buy it for you they would be really cool yeah nah too much damage for me off I go hey guys check this thing out it is a sail, a wood sailboat puzzle box. So there's one piece missing out of it here. So what you do is you slide this over, and there's a thing. But if it had that, was where it would lock into place. It would lock it into place, and then it would be a puzzle box thing. So parts are missing, and they went three bucks. Now where are you from? It looks like it's from Indonesia, or Vietnam, Vietnam. Nah. Parts are missing, but I do like those things. All right, have a go. Hey guys, check this out. It is a scotch broth soup bowl. This is the Chinese one. They want it for 50 cents. And scotch broth is lamb. It's lamb stock or broth. Uh, I used to make a lot of this stuff. It's If you like the lamb thing, and I love lamb, uh, there's only one bowl, but eh. It's cool. 50 cents, it's pretty cheap. I just don't need it. Uh, you don't see them very often, but it is good stuff. Off I go. Gravy. <laughs> you can make that out of it. Beep. Hey guys, check it out. It is a bake well pudding plate. Uh, I've never seen this one here. It's got like some sort of custardy thing with almond essence and strawberry jam for four bucks. Oof. And here's the thing. It's from um, it's from England. Uh, what to say? Something established 1810. I don't know what. I can't make out the stamp, but there it is. I would get this thing, but man, I have enough. I have like probably 20 of these things. Not the same exact one, but I've never seen this particular one. I have. Ugh, that's my stuff that I want to make a series for a uh, food channel thing out of. Ah, I'm going to pass on it, but that's really cool. All right. Four bucks isn't bad. I'm sure they make some money, but eh, I get enough of them. Off I go. Hey, guys, check this out. It is a 50th anniversary. See if you can see that in gold. I'm guessing it's like a candy dish thing. And over here, they want $4 for it, and it is, it has a little sticker on it. I've never heard of this thing. It is um, 22 karat lotus quality. I don't know if that's Japan or whatever, but it's really cool. Uh, 50. 50. 50. <laughs> I'm 57 years old, man, and I swear to God, it goes by really, really, really fast. Uh, uh, nah, I'm, I'm, it was a reflection thing. <laughs> I'm going to take a picture and get out of here. Off I go. 
guys. There's a couple of really cool vintage soda bottles. It's a brownie for five bucks. Taste the difference. And it's an original Royal Crown. That's RC to you and me for three dollars. These are chewed up and beat, but wow, they're really cool. You don't really see these that often anymore, but there they are. Picture. Have a go. Hey guys, there's a couple of really cool vintage soda bottles. It's a brownie for five bucks. Taste the difference. And it's an original Royal Crown. That's RC to you and me for three dollars. These are chewed up and beat, but wow, they're really cool. You don't really see these that often anymore, but there they are. Picture. Have a go. Here, over here, there's um, three, it looks like Fire King um, refrigerator boxes. And there's the Fire King thing, five bucks a piece. Ooh, just a little high for me, but there they are. Cool. Off will go. Hey guys, over at the um, <coughs> Manatee Memorial, uh, got excited and didn't, <laughs> didn't highlight these. Uh, these are uh, Blanco candle holders for a buck a piece. Uh, you kind of can't say no because it is what it is Oh, in here. See, they all got the sticker. And there you go. <laughs> One for the good guys. Off I go. Let's check these things out. They're, um, I guess they're from Halloween leftover skeleton candle things. Let's see if they light. And they want four bucks a piece for them. Woo! That one works with batteries in them and everything <laughs> for four bucks. Oh, one's green and one's red. That's kind of cool. Eh, I don't need those things, but they are neat. I love looking at this stuff. All right, I got to get out of here and turn these things off. Off I go. Check this out. It's a nurse. I'm guessing it's for pencils. That's really cute. I don't know what the signature is here on it. That's pretty neat. I don't know. Oh. What's it say? That's not right. It's folded over. It's five dollars. Eh, it's interesting, but it looks kind of like a 50s thing when they actually wore those things. All right. Now pass. Off I go. You guys, check this out. It's a really cool candy dish. I think I actually have one of these things somewhere. It's really cool. Yeah, I do, I, I, I do have this thing. I got to put away somewhere. How much you want four bucks that's pretty cool <laughs> I actually do have one and the, the little blue stuff in there is pretty neat all right I'm gonna pass I got one and off I go Beep. Hey guys, check out this clock it looks like it's 70s or 80s it is a homeco quartz and it's plastic it's got this interesting little weave thing going on with it uh, let's see what we got in the back here. Oh, okay, hold on. And they weren't five dollars for it. Nice mechanism. Hold on, I'm getting there. Uh, it's uh, oh, it's a uh, '79. Looks like, and it's a Burwood. Made in the USA. That's pretty cool. The mechanism's worth five bucks. I don't need that thing. I get, I have a whole bunch of clock parts. But it is neat. Let me spin that around and get a picture. That's definitely. 79. <laughs> All right, have a go. Hey guys, check it out. It's a Mammoth Cave Ceramic Ashtray. I guess that's in Kentucky. Never been to Kentucky. Four bucks they want. Oh, and let's see what we got here. We got a little extra. It's got a tag on it. Oops, Japan. So that's going to put it around 60s or 70s. I'm guessing. I don't need that thing. Never heard of it. Have a go. Yeah, check out this uh, ceramic owl. It almost looks like treasure craft, but it's not. He's got, he looks like he's been smoking something too. Look at his eyes, oh boy. And they want five bucks. That's pretty cool. I don't need it, it's, it's close, but it's, eh, I like owls, but that one's, looks like he's got a problem of some sort. All right, that's a passer and off I go. Boop. Guys, I'm getting ready to go into blessed and distressed over here, and there's this uh, Ford Ranger. Look at the hood, man. See if you can see it. It's got all kind of hail, hail damage on it. Wow. I don't know if you can see it real good, but man, it is bumpy. Wow. 
I've dealt with that stuff before. Woof, that sucks. Wow. Off I go. Hey guys, check this thing out. It's a stellar scope for five bucks. I've never seen anything like this. It looks like a, a I guess you plug in the time and the date. And what's this in here? Let's see what we got. See if you can see that. Oh, look inside. It's got the constellations in there. Oh, and over here. Okay, that's there's this thing, some sort of other thing. That's interesting. I guess, it, oh, this is a light, so it lights up. Wow, okay, aren't you clever? I've never seen anything like it. And then it's got a little booklet here, too. Wow, a line date with hour by rotating tubes. Hold stereo, the stellar scope vertically and orient by aiming uh, the respective symbols. Okay. Oh, and it's got other parts. It's got stuff in there. Oh, and there's other things over here. Wow, okay. Yeah, I have no need for that, but I've never seen anything like it. I will take a picture. And off I go. That was neat. Hey guys, check this thing out. It is, it's a polished stone with uh, red dragonflies and it's a paperweight for two bucks. And it's made in Vietnam, 92 something 03. Oh, I've never seen anything quite like that. It's interesting. Eh, nah, 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 nah. Off I go. Neat though. Okay, guys, this had me a little perplexed. It is Conga to Key Club. And it's got these little Key Club International little guys on it. For, and this is 50 cents. And the only thing I've ever heard of is a, a key party. I've never been to one, but I've heard about them. <laughs> but I don't know. I, I don't know what that means. Made in China. Oh. It is a thing, but it's not for me. <laughs> Off I go. Hey guys, check it out. This is really kind of cool. I think get the glare off. It's an actual painting of a, of a mother horse and her foal. Little baby. It has some damage over here, which sucks, but it's a real painting and it's signed right over there. Jim uh, Hasselton. It's $10. I don't know what that is on that. It might come out, but probably not. <laughs> See anything on the back? Uh, nope. It's interesting. Got damage though. Look at the eyes. The eye. Eh, get that clear off. Take a picture and get out of here. Off I go. Yeah, check this painting out. This reminds me of the highwaymen, uh, the, the Florida artist. I think they worked in Georgia too, but this is really, it's done really well for eight bucks. Wow. That's not bad at all. They did a really good job for what it is. Wow, that's really neat. Ah. It's got some time on it too. It's uh, Shirley Dell 2003, so it's 21 years old. It's old enough to drink. <laughs> I'll take a picture. Yeah, interesting. Eh, not for me. Off I go. Yeah, check it out. It's MASH, and this is Season 2 Collector's Edition for three bucks. Wow. That's back when it was really good. I watch all of those <laughs> with my dad. Well, I lay on the floor. And, oh my God, when Henry Blake died. Jesus, mother of God, that was a horrible thing. Uh, I don't need it. <laughs> I get that stuff for free, but it's neat. Off I go. Hey guys, I'm over here at Manatee Memorial and I found this book. It looks really old. It is, um, what's it say? Mal... Mugham or something of, of human bondage. This thing's old. Of human bondage. How old are you? Uh, it's the Sundial Press, Garden City, New York. Here we go. It is, what is it, 19, 1915. This is what it looks like it says. Let's see if I can get it clear. It's, I don't know why it's not coming in, but it says 1915. Let me clean my lens. Eh, I'm just looking around. It's an interesting little thing. 1915. Oh my god. <laughs> I need it not, but there it is. And off I go. 
guys check it out it's the uh, dancing nudes I don't know if you can really see it but they are nude in there it's girls it's a dollar I've seen this thing before I've actually had them eh, I don't think they get too much money now yeah it sucks that I can't can't really see see it because it's it's clear glass <laughs> that's a passer need enough though up I go